Managing your applications is not at all complicated in Inspira. You just go to the careers homepage and you choose a view to expand or shrink the list you work with. And if it's a sent application, basically follow the status. Nevertheless, I would spend some time on managing multiple draft applications, withdrawing an application and withdrawing yourself from a roster, but also placing your roster status on hold. You can use in Inspira multiple drafts for multiple categories of jobs without applying immediately. You will be in this way prepared for different types of job openings to ensure that you have precise and effective applications. You will find your draft applications in the list of applications, sometimes hidden three months before in the list, so you need a bit of patience here. If this is linked to an application, it's easier to find. If not and you have more, it might be confusing to choose between 12 drafts named no job. After you choose an application, continue as we have seen together in the previous video lessons. And something that might be useful, delayed draft applications that you don't use. To withdraw from a job application, you are using the same careers homepage, applications and click on withdraw my application. I've seen cases when people click on this by mistake, said yes by habit and they could not apply again for that job. So if you click on it, mean it, if you do it by mistake, don't confirm. To withdraw or put your career roster on hold, you go in the same careers homepage, look for your roster memberships and follow the link. You will have the options there, be careful withdrawing is permanent and it affects all current applications depending on the particular roster membership. And with this, we finish the short video on managing your applications. In the next section, we are going to spend some time discussing assessments and interviews and preparing you for the you have been shortlisted email.